Hi, welcome to Waymar Farms. Today we're going to talk to you about how much fun it is to make ice cream in your own home. As you know at Wayhar, we make our own ice cream and bottle our own milk. But I want to show you how you can make ice cream while you're stuck at home for the next couple days and what, what ingredients you need to do that. So first, we're going to take two cups of half and half, which is really is a light cream. I've asked my daughter Olivia to help with this this afternoon. In addition to the cream, what else are we adding, Olivia? Uh, heavy cream. Two cups of heavy whipping cream. What's next, Liv? It says uh, you need half a cup of white sugar. Go for it. We'll start to stir that up. We'll stir it real nice, nice and fun. What else do we need to add, Liv? What are we going to do? What's your favorite flavor of ice cream, Olivia? Uh, chocolate. Chocolate? Well, right now we're going to start with vanilla. That's the most basic flavor, and it's the number one flavor sold in the United States, is vanilla. Surprise, surprise. So, how much vanilla are we going to add to our ice cream today, Liv? We are going to add two teaspoons of vanilla extract. So while I'm stirring and she's measuring that out, everybody can think about doing this at home. It's a great family event. You can, you can make ice cream very simply. It's a rather pure process with only milk, cream, sugar, and flavorings. Perfect, Olivia. That's perfect. So once we have it all mixed together, we're going to pour it into to individual bags. So then we can do our shake, rattle, and roll to make ice cream. Here, Liv, let's pour some in the bag. We'll make, we'll break it up. You can break it up into two or three different batches. So what you want to do is you want to get all the air out, as much air as you possibly can, and make sure it's snap tight and seal tightly because you don't want to lose all this yumminess. Then we're going to put it in a second bag, as Olivia suggested, and we'll put it right inside. And again, you want to squish out all of the air so it's easy to make. Mix. And we have enough, we can do two or three more bags. So everybody will get a turn to make ice cream. Pour some in this bag. There we go. Perfect. Double bag it. So it's a lot of fun to make ice cream. This is something you can do in the afternoon as a snack or have it for, for your evening dessert. Make sure all the air is out of the bag. And then we get to the harder part. This is where you'll get some exercise today. We're gonna to take and put the double bag of mix into a bag of ice with lots of rock, ice and salt. Lots of salt to help work with the ice. Ta-da! Lots of ice. Seal them up tight so they don't so they don't leak together. You don't want to ruin your ice cream by getting all that rock salt mixed into that vanilla ice cream. You know, there's as many different flavors of ice cream as there are ingredients in the world. Can you, when you get a chance, send me your favorite flavor of ice cream. We'd like to know what you like. So this is now your exercise for the day. You can have gym class while you're making ice cream. Liv, show them how it's done. <laughs> You want to do this for about 10 minutes, and if it doesn't seem to be getting hard after 10 minutes, you can always shake it for a little bit longer until your ice cream starts to get hard. Something you could take it outside, you could exercise, you can throw it back and forth, just squeeze it, shake it, dance around the, of the kitchen with it, whatever you want to do to make it look good. And it will take a while. It'll take 7 to 10 minutes for your ice cream to finish. Keep shaking, Liv. So we're still mixing. Liv and I are in a race to see who's made better ice cream. And I think I'm going to win. You have more ice cream. It's a good family event. Right? You can have a race to see who makes the most ice cream, the best ice cream, and the fastest ice cream. All right, Liv, I'm ready to open mine up. I'm not. She's wearing gloves, but that's okay. 
So as you can see, my ice cream is really formed. It's really gotten, gotten hard. To make it easier to scoop it, I'm just gonna cut a corner and squeeze it out into my serving bowl. This will be our very first batch today of homemade ice cream. Look how smooth and creamy and luscious that looks. It turned out good. Yeah, it, did. it really did. It's nice and hard. Here we go, Liv. Take a bite and see what you think. Everybody loves ice cream. Mm -hmm. One of our favorite desserts in America, and we can all tell why, because it's, it's loaded with calcium, milk, and your favorite flavor. So join us tomorrow when we share with you more stories about dairy products and life at Wayhar Farms. We hope you have a great afternoon, and please visit us soon. And don't forget to comment on what your favorite flavor of ice cream is. Have a great day.